Yo, what's up guys? It's Symbiote Addiction 22. Back at you with another video. Now today, um, obviously, I'm not going to be doing anything scary or fun today. Um, only because I know I have some stuff I need to go ahead and do. Um, one of them, obviously, is working on my script for the movie, The Ultra Ego. Which is going to possibly be coming out. And I want to say the latest is probably sometime next year. That's my. That's probably what I'm... Uh, um, have it at right now only because I know I have to work and then gotta be up and out doing a bunch of stuff so just kind of trying to get everything done um, definitely going to try to have this done either by the end of this year or possibly next year um, I will definitely keep you guys updated like I said it's just going to be me myself and I in this movie so it is really hard trying to um, Work on a script that only involves yourself and not nobody else in it, it which would be awesome if it did. It'd be perfect if I had somebody else in here with me to do this movie. But you know what they say: you get sometimes there are things you gotta do by yourself that really isn't easy. But you know, it's one of those things where it's like you you can overcome it. You can jump over those obstacles and do whatever it is that you set your mind to. So um, that's definitely what I'm going to be doing. So, um, cutting all distractions out, meaning no, no love interest, none of that. I don't want any part of that right now because, like I said, I'm a busy person. So, I'm kind of up and running around doing everything. So, um, I will have time for you guys, obviously. You guys are my fans and I love you guys from the bottom of my heart. I love you guys. So, I will always have time in my day to go ahead and message you guys so if you if you guys ever feel free to message me um go ahead and do so in the comments below or um yeah just the comments below and i'll be more than happy to message back to you guys and i always do I always reply back to my fans always um i mean you can ask my boy colton I usually message him on a uh, facebook messenger but he'll usually message me here in the comments below and i'll usually always reply back um, I'm never disrespectful to anybody. I'm always up and honest, never judgmental, never criticizing anybody either. So don't, don't make me out to be that person because I'm not, I'm really not that person. I'm a really cool person, really laid back, um, goofy, obviously. So, um, you guys can always feel free to message me here in the comments below. If you'd like, um, always here to message you guys. It's just the people in outside of YouTube. Yeah, I have to put to the side because this is what I do. It's what I love to do. I love to do YouTube. So, first thing I want to go ahead and say is that I will be going to Orlando, Florida um, next weekend. So, um, during that time, I will be doing a travel vlog with you guys while, um, while we're heading up there. Now, I won't be recording while I'm in the uh, airport because, obviously, if most... For most of you guys that have been to the airport, you guys know how hectic it gets. So, it's it's tough. I'm going to say that. It's, it's very tough trying to, you know, be there and then having to record something that you have to obviously... That you guys actually have to sit there and obviously wait to get past. And then obviously they're not going to let you. And they might not even let you have the camera in there in the first place. So, um... I'm hoping that they'll allow me to have my camera. Obviously, for most people, I know that you'll probably be able to, but I'm really hoping that they do because I need that. I really need that in order to um, reach out to you guys and let you guys know how my day to day, my day to days, my day to day daily basis of a routine that I do here goes. And I'm sorry, it's just been a long day for me. <laughs> so. Just bear with me here. Um, yeah, so I'll be going to Florida here next weekend. So um, I may end up going to Universal Studios. I'll probably be going there and or Disney. Man, it's one of those two or both possibly. Um, I know they'll have a Halloween party over at uh, Universal Studios. So I'm definitely trying to attend that. And then um, I'll definitely be going through the little haunted mazes and stuff like that. But I know they won't let us do video photography in there. So... Um, what I'll do is I will um, kind of 
do like a little tour, I guess, of us going in. And then once we get like almost, almost like to the line, to like the um, very front of the line to get in, I'll go ahead and cut it off. Or at least, um, well, actually, I, I gotta think about that because that's that'd be tough. Cause like I said, well, actually, never mind. Scratch that. Cause it's like a it's a small video camera, so it should be able to fit in my pocket. So, nah, I'm gonna bring. Like I said, I'm gonna bring it with me so that way I can go ahead and film it up there. And then once we get to the front of the line of the maze, I'll go ahead and you know obviously cut it off, and then we'll go through. And then, once we get out, I'll go ahead and record again. And then we can actually talk about the experience that we just went through in there. Um, other than that, um, obviously, I have one other, one other thing I want to go ahead and mention. And I do have a couple of other things I need to go ahead and say, too, as well. But, um, obviously, you guys see my shirt. So, apparently, you guys know that I work at FedEx Ground. Yes, I work over there at FedEx Ground. I've been working there for at least a year and five months at most. So, um, not bad. Not really bad at all. Um, getting paid a good amount of money. Um, like I said, this is why I want to do YouTube so I can make an extra bit of income as well. Because it will definitely help me in the long run, especially when I want to um, travel around. So, that's kind of why I want to do this. It's because I feel like it will help in the long run. But, yeah, so apparently... Last month, my hard work has been recognized by the managers there, and they definitely gave me a, um, an award, I guess, for Package Handler of the Month. So, as you guys can see, it says FedEx Ground, um, ZCon 250. Um, I don't know what that means, so I can't really explain that to you guys, but it says Outbound 1, Package Handler of the Month, 2019, and then... At the bottom, it says September, and then, of course, you see my name. So, you know, just trying to really put in the hard work that I do at my job. So, in that way, people will, I guess, not like acknowledge, but when I guess when it comes to wanting to get another job, if it's not FedEx, then I can at least say, oh, yeah, you know, I've worked so hard, and I put so much effort, and obviously, with all that effort and hard work that I put in that I've gotten a package handler of the month award so that would obviously be a big plus and bonus into my resume that I could put in there which would allow me to go ahead and do another job if it was like Amazon that would be easy I'd be able to get that job with ease um right now of course I'm working full time so I'm not really trying to do a second job because obviously I wouldn't have time to do this so um Nonetheless, um, there is going to be a Comic-Con coming up in December, so I'm definitely looking forward to attending that, and with that being said, there is going to be a new cosplay suit that I will be bringing in. Um, now, it's not going to be a symbiote suit at all. It's not going to be no symbiote, no Venom, no Carnage, no Anti-Venom, none of that stuff, and it's not going to be Spider-Man either. Um, it's not going to be Kane as well, none of that. But speaking of Kane, sometime next year I will be getting a um a new mask and i want to be able to go ahead and review that with you guys as well so um definitely look forward to that so um yes there will be a new cosplay suit coming up in november so it'll be sometime next month for sure um like i said it's not going to be any spider-man suits no symbiote suits none of that so i definitely want to be able to do something completely different and, um, obviously in January, they're going to have an Ichiban Con, so, um, I definitely want to go ahead and wear that suit towards that time. Now, the one in December, I'm going to be wearing, and I hate to have this, that, and I hate that I have to say this, but it's going to be my Wakanda Spider-Man suit, and the only reason I say that is because the one that they had in August, I was going to go to, but when I went there, it was already raining, so it was... It already seemed pointless to be able to dress up and go in, so it kind of ruined the whole thing, so I couldn't even go. So, in December, I'm actually going to be wearing that Wakanda Spider-Man suit, so definitely um, be on the lookout, because I will be filming up there, and I'll have my friend up there with me as well, so it'll be all the more better. Um, 
I am going to be working on my uh, White Lantern Batman suit as well, so I'm definitely looking forward to finishing that up. Um, there's not much that I need left. The only thing I'm going to really need is the um, the gauntlets, the belt, and the uh, the boots. That's about it. And, of course, the airbrush, because I want to go ahead and um, definitely want to change the color of it, but... Um, that I won't be wearing until possibly June, because I know they're going to have another Comic-Con coming up around that time, and I think it's a good idea if I just wear it then, instead of trying to get everything done and rushing everything, and I got too much to worry about right now, so that's going to be the big, that's going to kind of be the, um, the biggest thing that I'm going to try to go ahead and get finished at that time, when that time comes around, but for now, I want to go ahead and just get everything that I need now out the way. So, with that being said, um, that's pretty much about all I really need to go ahead and tell you guys. Um, if you guys love this video, give this video a thumbs up. Um, definitely make sure you guys subscribe, and the subscribe button will be right here. Right where my finger's pointing at. My big finger. Yep, right there. Right where you see that um, Venom Symbiote logo. Click that, and I will officially join you guys into my symbiotic army of spider-man lovers and you know we always have fun here all the time always 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 um that um definitely make sure you guys hit the notification bell so that way you guys can um be notified when i put up new videos because i mean if some of you guys want new videos you definitely want to make sure that you have the notification bell on so that way you guys can um, be tuned in to when I put up new stuff so that way you guys will never miss anything at all that I post up here on YouTube but um, yes we are on our way to 300 subscribers we are at 207 right now so I want to definitely give a big shout out to all of you guys for uh, making this possible for me um, I do actually have a I actually have something that I want to try but um, I'm not going to do it until I get back at least I definitely want to try something because um, it was either the Tokyo treats that I want to try or something different. But it was for the um, the video that was like if we get five, 15 views and or 9 likes, I'll go ahead and do the tasty treats with you guys. Um, I definitely want to do that. But I also wanted to try to do something else if not that. So um, like I said, it's going to be one wild ride and... Um, I'm going to definitely try to get that out the way sometime when I get back, for sure. Um, like I said, it's, it's not going to take forever. Uh, I'm actually going to do the other one first, and then I'll do the Tokyo Treats next. Because I actually want to try and see if it actually tastes good. So I definitely want you guys to be there with me to um, experience this. So anyways, like I said, this has been Symbiote Addiction 22. And I'm signing out, and I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your Sunday. Peace.